you know, Brian and I, we played in a number of groups uh, before we even met Sam uh, on the East Coast, and we moved up together. Yeah, actually, uh, Brent and Brian both played in my band for a time. Uh, they'd come over together from Halifax as some kind of package deal. A package deal? No, there was uh, absolutely no, there was no package deal. You know, I remember playing with Sam, I think some of the first shows he played under that name. It was in this little club up in the Junction. And uh, he had a weekly job there going. He used to do three, four sets a night. He'd just play all night. And, uh, and there was a little piano, so I used to go up and uh, tinkle the ivories. And, you know, he used to play all those old songs. He did Paper Doll and uh, the Hippopotamus song and lots of old ragtime numbers. That was a real, uh, those are some really good shows. And I think still some of the best material. I don't think he's even recorded a lot of that stuff. It's quite good. But, uh, so yeah, it was the two of us. Sometimes, you know, a friend would come by and sing and a, you know, a violin player one time. But I don't know where Brian was at that time. You know, I think Brian was, I think Brian was down here in America touring with some rock and roll group. But, uh, yeah, there was no package deal. Years later, Brian joined the group and we were all playing together. You know, around the time we did the album. This was long before Brian left to go front quite nice which had Brent on bass um, because they were a package deal. Uh, so I think after they recorded their first record, Brent decided to up and move to California, which kind of put Brian in a tough spot considering, you know, they were a package deal. Yeah, so the, the couch had just fell on me and hit my head. Uh, so I was at home all summer, just high as hell on Percocet. And so I, while I was working out my songs, I think, uh, and playing them, Brent was on bass and Darcy from the Mellow Grove band was on drums. But then Brent moved to L.A. So I'm thinking, I need a bass player. Who the fuck plays bass? So Brian was pretty hard up for a bass player, and uh, I really wasn't working much at the time, to be honest. And so I called Sam, because Brent had left, and I was like, man, remember that time I slept on that bass? That's your bass. You play, you, will you play bass and quite nice, you know, you cop in for Brent. And immediately, of course, he was like, yeah, I play bass. Um, no, Sam doesn't play bass. So when he called me up and asked about that bass on my couch, I was like, yeah, sure, I can play that. So I joined quite nice, filling in for Brent on bass. Bass? No, Sam, Sam's not a bass player. He's a guitar player. Sam, Sam can't play bass. I never played bass before a day in my life. 